Hey Christopher, just want to show you today was actually just was kind of a really interesting day. Uh, the system did really well. We had all kinds of primary trades. So let's go over the primary trade. So this was the U.S. session open at 8.30 a.m. Uh, Chicago time. Globex, this is the NQ instrument, which is the equivalent of the NAS 100 if you're trading FX. Uh, of course, we have the YM, which is like the Dow 30 in FX, and we have the ES, which is the S&P 500. And, you know, there's the equivalent uh, instrument uh, in, as a CFD, contract for difference, that you can trade. So you can trade all three of these indices, whether you're trading FX or futures. Uh, we did have the market bounce off support in the overnight session and lift right into the first part of the morning. We had a, a had a, a good setup there for anybody trading the uh, pre-market lead-in to the U.S. session open. After the U.S. session open, we had some lift, and then we had 9 o'clock news play out. We did get one of our primary setups, which is a M pattern leading up to a momentum shift, where we get the arrow where we transition from upside momentum to downside. That was kind of a one and done trade. You could have been completely done for the day on that trade. We did have some lift after the initial run. We came down into recent support, pressed a little bit, and right away responded to that, bounced. You can see the new trend indicator. Our trend bias tool maintained a downward trend. And then we got another primary setup. This is a trend following setup where we have a trend in place. The market lifts, kicks back into our new trend indicator, rolls over, and we get this bigger vertical bar. We call it a drive bar. And that was another uh, beautiful run. So the first two trade primary trades out of the day uh, work like a champ. Okay, later on, uh, we get into the mid part of the day, the afternoon. And we get another primary trade set up. So we had pullback, lift, pullback, lift. We have a W pattern uh, leading into a, you know, into a uh, structural shift in price direction, meaning we're going from a downtrend to an uptrend. But right here, we had an equal low, almost like a mini double bottom, and then we get the long signal. That lifted a bit, had a slight pullback, held, didn't come anywhere near our stop down near most recent price pivot. Then we got another primary trade. We get pullback to the new trend, trend bias indicator, and we get a drive bar. And that was a, a trade that ended up, either trade ended up working well. So for some reason, you still weren't done trading. And you're hanging all the way to the end of the day, which is you know roughly about three o'clock U.S. Central Time. See the market consolidated a bit, but the market was not really able to break out higher. And what do we get right into the last oh I don't know twenty minutes of the day? We get an M, and then a structural short signal. So we had we had uh, let me get a mark. We had one primary trade today, two, three, four, five, they all worked. 100% win to loss ratio today. Now, I've been getting a lot of questions on back testing and all that. In my opinion, when you're showing or teaching or utilizing a manual discretionary based system, this is not automated. So it's, it's a visually efficient set of tools uh, that has one very significant capability. I can go in and I can fine tune my new bars, my time frame by tick. So I can really make very fine and precise adjustments to the time frame. That's, that's important. I'm not stuck on a one minute chart. Then I have to jump to a five minute chart, then to a 15. Those are too big of gaps. So some systems that, that look like they could work okay in a five minute chart, and then they look like they could be okay in a 15 minute chart. You might, you know, you never realize it, that system might work phenomenal on the seven minute chart or nine minute. But if you're on MT4, MT5, you can't go to the, you can't fine tune the time frame. That's one benefit of putting this on NinjaTrader. 
The other massive benefit on NinjaTrader, let's say you're trading the NAS100. I can get my feed to track the futures, which is tick by tick data. So everything is being powered by nanosecond level tick by tick data, or I can pipe in some FXCM feed and get every tick uh, as the Forex data uh, and track the NAS100. So, you know, NinjaTrader has the capability to power hybrid Renko kind of style of candlesticks and using that granular level tick data. TradingView doesn't have this yet. TradingView, I think, what do we can get? We can get down to, you know, some of the mid-level or low-level subscriptions. I think you can get to one-minute data, maybe as low as 30-second data. So you're getting a snapshot of the data. Uh, you're not getting every tick of the data. They call it, uh, you know, aggregate data or snapshot data. So TradingView is giving you data where they look at the scrolling data that's going by at the nanosecond level and taking a picture of it every once in a while and sending that price uh, positioning information to you. Now, I do have plans, and it's not going to be till late in June, or early July. I am going to try to get the new algo system onto TradingView for those that just won't use NinjaTrader and they want to use TradingView because I'm getting about a massive demand for the system in TradingView. I've even had one group say, hey, we'll take the whole system, put it on TradingView. What's the price we want the system? And then we'll run with it. And I said, no, I don't want to do that. Um, if we're going to use this system on, on TradingView, I'm going to recommend a person have the highest subscription level that has the uh, most granular data possible, and I think I can pull it off because I have really, really good programmers. Uh, but anyhow, I just want you to see that, you know, the primary trade, we have primary trade setups, secondary trade setups, and aggressive trade setups. We also have some trade setups that I call lower time frame. There are much lower time frames. You can go in and attack these linear runs of price that meet certain criteria that I teach from my 18 years of full-time trading. Uh, so anyhow, uh, this is the new algo system. We're currently in stage one launch. I'm gonna wrap it up here uh, probably in the next few days. I'm gonna close everything down. Then stage two will come out. That will be a monthly subscription model. I'll have a website up. I'll have some back testing data uh, put up there and you know walk forward testing data and related. Uh, the other thing is our primary trade setups will be at that point when we do stage two, when the price goes up, all these signals that I showed you would have been automated signals with alerts on the chart. Now, I think it's very simple to see them and trade them. Uh, and I even have a range of new uh, traders and they said they like this because it's very clean and they like my very extensive training. So I really methodically get into all the details of the system, how to work the trades, in trade management, you know, position uh, or, you know, entry, stop management and all that. Uh, so anyhow, we'll have that as stage two, but you know, that's good. We're gonna launch at a $77 a month pricing model and there'll be some other things added, but for the most part, the biggest thing will be the automated signals with alerts that you can toggle on or off if you want them. Another thing with the system, all the colors and all the indicators are fully adjustable as far as colors go and shading. Uh, the bars themselves and the time frame are micro adjustable. So you could build like five or six different time frames per instrument for different things. That's how you can have a swing trading time frame. You could have a hyper scalping time frame. You can have a quick intraday position trading time frame. That's a huge advantage to have. Uh, in a system uh, for when you want to use it. So if you have any questions, stage one launch is $397, one time pay, get the tools and all updates free for a year. So when stage two comes out, you get it for free. Uh, if I do stage three, let's say in October, you get it for free. So it's kind of a special deal for the early adopters uh, and, uh, and I'm getting a lot of good ideas. I already have two things I'm going to add in stage two that were good ideas that I never even thought of that came from 
uh, some of the early adopters, and there's been phenomenal uh, feedback so far. I haven't had any negative feedback. I've had all positive, and that's that's really nice to see that traders are kind of getting it. And what I like about it, what I wanted to see, they're right away able to deploy it and be effective with the system. That's important. I don't want you sitting here for three months like, you know, order flow or auction market theory or, you know, you know, Fibonacci's or whatever, trying to figure out over three months how to learn something. Hey, here's the, here's the visual tools that are visually efficient. Here's the setups. Here's the, the trade management. Go get it. But then backed up with a lot of extensive training from 18 years of trading experience to give you uh, as much translated from my years of experience into your hands to make sure you're trading at the most optimal levels possible. If you have any questions, contact us at info at neualgo.com. Talk to you soon.